piston slap could be the cause of any knocking or rattling noises coming from your car. This terrifying sound is frequently a sign that one or more pistons are failing. However, as it almost exclusively occurs on older car models, you probably won't hear this noise in a newer car. In this video, we go over the definition of piston slap and possible causes. We'll also discuss fixing a piston slap. It's the Car Problems YouTube channel. Subscribe and let's get started. What is piston slap? When the piston rocks inside the cylinder, piston slap occurs. It should only move up and down, but it rocks back and forth instead. It frequently indicates that the piston has too much room in the cylinder. The walls ought to hold the piston in place when everything is functioning normally. There are knocking and rattling sounds as the piston's skirt collides with the cylinder walls. The engine can suffer from a piston slap, especially if heavy loads are applied while the knocking sound is present. This occurs when there is an excessive distance between the piston and the cylinder. The piston will consequently begin to rock side to side while moving up and down, its sides contacting the cylinder walls. Additional mechanical harm, such as scratches and scorches, can easily result from this. Piston slap appears as cars get older due to normal wear and tear. Often, when a vehicle is idle, the noise is louder. Since piston slap in newer car models is extremely uncommon, as we previously mentioned, we strongly advise conducting a proper diagnosis before disassembling the engine. What causes piston slap? Piston slap is primarily caused by worn pistons or cylinder walls that leave an excessive gap between the piston and the cylinder wall. The piston starts to rock side to side, creating what is known as piston slap. When the piston to wall clearance gets too large, Compared to iron blocks, it occurs more frequently with aluminum blocks. Additionally, because of the additional cold clearance, there might be louder piston slap when the engine is first started. The check engine light might illuminate if the piston starts to fail. When something is wrong in contemporary vehicles, the onboard diagnostic system transmits an error code. You ought to be able to identify the specific affected cylinder using an OBD2 scanner. Knocking, however, can also be brought on by other problems, such as a dirty fuel injector or an ignition system issue. How to fix piston slap You can determine how to resolve piston slap by comprehending what it is. To fully fix the issue, you must ascertain what brought it about. Start by examining the pistons to determine their state. To do this, you must disassemble the engine. You should take your car to a certified mechanic if you don't have the necessary experience. The piston slap is typically brought on by this important component banging against the cylinders. The only solution in this situation is to purchase a new piston. You need to run an engine compression test before applying this fix. It might not be worthwhile to replace the piston if the engine has other problems or if your car is older. Make sure to replace the rings if you decide to go ahead with a piston replacement. Some of the issues you're having could have been caused by faulty piston rings. Additionally, since the engine will already be apart, this is the ideal time to replace the piston rings. It can cost $1,000 or more to replace a piston, making it a very pricey repair. Because of this, many owners of older cars decide against replacing the piston at all. The defective piston will initially make a lot of noise, but there might not be any long-term effects. Get the piston replaced if you intend to keep your car so that less serious engine damage doesn't result. 